Hey guys, Troy here, and like I said in my last video, seconds later, here I am making a new one <laughs> after I discovered the mass storage I had earlier. Um, so this is another tutorial, and it's on one of my favorites, so yeah, there's a couple of quite a few updates on this guy, so let's get on to it. So just get this out of the way. Uh and here here we have Scrap Heap uh in his car mode. And I did add some wheels on just like I did with uh smokestack. Um, I also added some headlights onto the feet, and I added some black one by ones in the back. Um, I added this random piece just to, I don't know, add some character onto it and make it look slightly better. Um, nothing's different back here, except for these blue one by ones and the... Uh, uh, brake lights and the turn signal lights. Unfortunately, I do not have that on the top. Now, you could, you could easily just, um, if you wanted to make this guy an ambulance, you could. You can, you can bring a hairball in. Just get that out of the way. Um, you could easily just, uh, make this guy an ambulance and put... Uh, some one by ones on top, and here he is just saving humanity. Wee! Um, <laughs> it's, um, he can hold a gun. Uh, if I can find a gun around here, yeah, sure, we'll just use a mi uh, stud shooter. You can't hold a gun with his actual hand, which I find it pretty interesting. Just, just like that. Kind of looks awkward. I don't care. So yeah, let's get on to building. This guy is going to be quite an is interesting one to build. So we're going to build, um... We're going to build this in sections, but I'm going to do it in the same format as I did with the Transformer. If you know what I mean, uh, that bulky Transformer that I made. Nice G-joint head. Anyway, so section one will be the arms, and I'm going to build the arms first, just as soon as I discuss the sections. And then I'll show you the parts for legs. And start building them, and then, and so and so with the others. So yeah, section one will be the arms, section two will be the legs, section three will be the torso, hinges, and head, and section five, I guess you could say, is the backpack. Huh, that actually brings up something. This thing will not be a perfect transformer more because and eh, screw it. That piece is no longer on there. That way it can be a perfect transformer. So yeah. Uh let's get to building section one. Okay, so here are all the parts you're gonna need. Just uh, uh, make two of every part you see here, and here's how to build it. What you're gonna do is take a, one of these, one of these, just connect them together. Take one of these, put it on like that. Um, this goes on top of there like that. And we can actually make this in car mode, but I would prefer to do it in robot mode, so. Yeah. So we'll just leave it like uh, this 
for right now, and then put your, oh, put your one by ones on just like that, and yeah, that's correct, and then what you're going to do is basically mirror the build just like that. Oh, sorry for that random moment of, uh, that came up right there. Um, so next what you're going to do is you need to uh, double up all the pieces once again. And so you're going to take one of these, the 1x6, put your grill pieces on like that. They don't have to be grill pieces. Put your t wheels on. Put your clip on there, then you take your jumper, jumper plate, jumper plate, I'm just kidding, uh, so take your one black one by one, and then your trans yellow one by one, right there, have it facing out, and in robot mode, you want the black stud to be out, that would be his toe. Just like that, and there's your pair of legs. You don't really have to mirror the build, but yeah. So here are all the pieces you're going to need for section 3. Just kind of kind of built together, but there, it's actually pretty simple. So yeah, let's get on to building this. Um, take this. Um, gosh, I'm fading out, guys. Um, yeah, so th just going to attach that piece on right there, just like that, and, um, attach these pieces on right there. And actually, what you're going to do is, you're going to have him up like this. And there's that piece. And finally, we're going to build this. Um, so, yeah, two, one of these bars, one of these on there. Uh, one of these, uh, two of these vertical clips, uh, one by two, bar, robot arm. And it's pretty obvious with this. And... Kind of obvious how they go together. Ugh. Kind of got a crook in my neck. So. The end, it should look something like this. Um, hang on a second, guys. Yeah, it does go here. Just like that. Yeah, that's right. Now we'll just build everything, put everything all together. So, let me just move in a more comfortable position, so you're going to take section 3, yeah, section 3, and kind of, uh, get this back into center, uh, so just connect these two pieces, just like that, and then kind of just put this on his back, Exactly like that. So then we'll put on his legs. So, like I said, the black toe will... The black, one by one, will become his toe. Well, toes or something like that. And in, in, when it's in car mode, uh, just like this, I like to think of the black part as the brake of the car.
that'd be kind of funny because it would only have one uh, front brakes only. So then you're going to take this piece, just attach it on like that, fold that up. Yeah, that's looking correct. Um, and you should have this at the end. Now, um, why I had to take this piece off is because uh, the main piece right here would not fit through these studs. So, yeah, it simply just wouldn't work. But if you wanted to just take this piece off, transform it, and then put it back on, you would put it on kind of like this. Or you could do it like this, or like this, or any way you wanted to. But one, this hinge is too loose, and two, it just doesn't work. So yeah, here is Scrap Heap built, and here's the updated version. So yeah, I will see you in the next video.